Hello, crafty friends, and welcome back. It's Terry with Terry's Mailbox, and today I'm here presenting for Cut Cardstock. Um, they asked us to use their beautiful pop tone cardstock, so I'm really excited to present this card for you. And again, this is um, Pink Fresh. I use their hexagon die and their hexagon stamp set to create this, this card. So the first thing I did was I am silver heat embossing on Cut Cardstock's White Cougar. Um, it's just 80 pound cardstock. So again, this is just gonna be the base for my card and I will be doing some coloring and additional die cutting here. So again, here I am just adding the silver embossing powder. And you can see my center space has a uh, blank space in it, but I'm not worried about that because I replaced it with that Thinking of You stamp. And that's actually what I'm going to use in the center of my card today. So I'm just kind of popping out all these pieces. And I just love the layered look uh, that I was able to achieve with this particular, particular die cut. So I cut it out in four additional pop-tone um, cardstock colors. So I use Bearalicious, Blue Raspberry, Grapesicle, and Grape Jelly. And then what I'm doing is I'm actually gluing all of the frames together so that when you look at the card from the side, you almost get the feeling of a purple-blue uh, rainbow. And I love cool colors. If you if you follow me, you'll, you'll notice I use the cool colors quite a bit. So again, I'm just affixing the last colored piece Piece here and this is the um, this is the grape jelly piece that I'm putting here on the top and then I'm going to attach that white piece that has the um, embossed silver lines on it so again I think this turned out really cool and again it gives a nice deep well to put those hexagons in so then what I did was I just kind of around the periphery of um, that the hexagons there in the center, I added the darker colors of the cardstock, kind of in a rotating, in a rotating manner. And then what I did was I pulled out some of my Copic markers in matching colors. So I kind of painted the flowers in both the purples and the teal colors. And again, two of my absolute favorite colors. So here I am just kind of coloring in all of those um, all of those pieces and I made my leaves kind of that teal color and then the flowers are mostly uh, mostly the purple shades. So I'm just kind of coloring away and all you really have to do is just kind of touch the touch the areas. They're not big enough to do any kind of shading or any fancy fancy coloring. So again, this is the kind of coloring I really like. So just kind of filling in those spaces. And then the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to pop those into that uh, circle of hexagons around that center 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 on the card. So I'm just kind of deciding how I want to arrange them. Then I'm grabbing my glue and just popping them in. Sometimes you have to use a little tool to push them down because the the frame is so thick. But we're almost done. I'm just making sure that final final one piece goes uh, goes down where I want it. So there's my card here. Again, presenting for cut card stock today. This is my hexagon card. And again, this is Terry with Terry's Mailbox. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Blogger, and YouTube. Come follow me.